Races have always been Ducati's inspiration for its super sport bikes. As everyone knows, sportiness is in our DNA in various forms. There is the most extreme one, Desmosedici, used in MotoGP races, then Panigale V4 and V2. And finally, we can have the one you can have fun with both on track and on the road. Here is the new Supersport 950. Sport 950 is the right bike to bring sporty riding into everyday life without having to make any compromises, especially in terms of comfort. It has a complete electronic suite, thanks to the introduction of the inertial unit. It is the Ducati that best combines sportiness and everyday road use. Ideal also for young people who want to approach the world of super sport bikes. High handlebars for more control and a seat revised in terms of longitudinal roominess to maximize the comfort for riders of different heights. For 2021, the Super Sport 950 acquires stylistic elements of the Panigale family. But to talk about its look, I leave the floor to Julian Clement, who designed it. When we started designing the entry model of the Ducati sports range, we wanted to create a very strong link with the model that most represents the sportiness of the brand, the Panigale V4. The fairings have been completely redesigned to accentuate the sportiness of the bike and the fluidity of the shapes. The air vents from the water cooler are inspired by the double extractor of the Panigale V4 models, but have been revised in a slightly less racing but more elegant form. They end with a panel that closes on the frame to accentuate the tight feel on the sides. The front view is completely redefined thanks to a new full LED headlight supported by two fins and flanked by air inlets that widen the view. The DRL, made with an opal screen that diffuses the light homogeneously, clearly recalls the sharp luminous signature of the Panigale V4. The headlight is equipped with two two-function LED modules, beam and high beam, and this allows a symmetrical view in all light switching modes. The modules are inserted in the frame with a brilliant finish that gives this technological component the preciousness of a jewel. The lower part now extends to the side silencer, hiding the mechanics and visually reminiscent of track bikes. The fairings connect the tank through two muscular shoulders around the trellis frame that make the whole motorcycle body more compact. This connection integrates an internal channel which, starting from the air inlets on the sides of the headlight, brings fresh air to the rider's legs in order to improve thermal comfort while riding. We have redesigned the padding on the seat to increase roominess and riding comfort. 
The upholstery uses a new sporty fabric enriched with visible stitching and an aesthetic pattern on the sides of the passenger seat. The exhaust system is made of two cylindrical pipes in brushed aluminium. A Krapovich type approved slip-on exhausts are available in the performance catalogue. After having imagined and followed the development of a bike for so many months, the best thing is to be able to saddle up and try it. I have personally very much appreciated its beautiful balance of sportiness to be used on the road combined with AD riding position that allows covering long distances without getting tired. Since the handlebars are obviously higher and more comfortable than those of a super sport bike, the space they occupy while steering didn't allow us to create a classic sporty headlight fairing. We used this constraint to create a new concept and design the cockpit area. The headlight fairing goes underneath the instrument panel to frame it and create a bridge connecting it to the tank. The use of colours also on the bridge is particularly appreciated while riding. This is the same concept we find on the Multistrada V4. The tank is narrow in the connecting area with the seat to offer good ergonomics. At the front, the shoulders widen to create a diamond shape typical of Ducati sports bikes. The electronics is one of the areas most affected by the development of the Supersport 950. We have introduced a new full LED symmetrical headlight with DRL daytime running lights. Then a new 4.3 inch color TFT instrument panel inspired by Panigale graphics was created. This instrument panel is the ideal interface to display all the information related to the use of the bike, such as the three riding modes, sport, touring and urban, which give a variety of controls for power levels and throttle management, differentiated according to the riding mode selected. The new Supersport 950 features the latest generation of electronic driving aids like ABS cornering, traction control, wheelie control, quick shifter, all aimed at maximizing safety during road and track sporting use. By the way, I remember the fantastic performance achieved during the ABS tests in terms of deceleration. I remember the deceleration peaks of 11 meters per square second when braking from 150 to zero. This resulted in a reduction of stopping distances and the improvement of active safety for the rider. But how was this possible thanks to the implementation of the inertial unit that acts as an observer of the vehicle? It provides, in fact, all the information on the dynamics of the bike in real time, in particular on how it moves with respect to the six axes, that is, if it is accelerating, decelerating, if it is moving on the yaw angle, or if it is leaning to left or right, and we also know of how many degrees. All this information is processed by our control units that manage traction control, ABS cornering, and wheelie control, creating a sort of safety net that improves performance and helps the rider in case of error. The Supersport 950 has the genetic makeup of a true sports bike and its features declare it openly. Single-sided swinging arm of clear racing derivation, trellis frame fixed to the engine, which acts as a stressed member to reduce weight and overall dimensions. Sporty ergonomics with raised handlebars to maximize control even when riding with a passenger. The seat has been revised to maximize rider comfort by allowing more longitudinal movement, especially on long distances. Multi-adjustable suspensions and three-spoke Y-shaped aluminium rims. Pirelli Diablo Rosso three tires, excellent on dry surfaces but really high performing on wet asphalt. Radial brake and clutch master cylinders and high performance Brembo braking system with two generously sized 320mm front discs. Truly sporty dry weight, 184 kg. The interventions that have affected the fairing have not only been of an aesthetic nature, but have seen also the creation of new ducts to direct fresh air to the rider's legs, thus improving thermal comfort and new slits to divert the hot air from the engine to the outside. 
so as to keep the rider in a still air bubble at a pleasant temperature, all assisted by an adjustable height screen. Twin cylinder engine with classic Ducati L-shaped architecture, Desmodronic timing system, testa stretta 11 degrees, four valves per liquid cooled cylinder, hydraulically operated clutch and radial master cylinder. The testa stretta 11 degrees now complies with Euro 5 regulations. It's perfect for sporty road riding with 80% torque already available at 3,500 RPM. Great torque that helps to get out of the curve even in case of gear selection error and great control at low speed. There will also be a 35 kilowatt version for those approaching a sports Ducati for the first time. The Supersport 950 is available with red colouring and, for those who want a more refined chassis, there is the S version in Ducati red and matte white. The Supersport 950 S is equipped with fully adjustable Olin suspension with a generously sized 48mm fork. This suspension increases the rider's feel, offering great support and stability in sport riding, both on track and on the road characterizing our Supersport 950S in an even sportier way. In addition, the Supersport 950S is equipped with a seat cover which makes it a single-seater, giving it an even sportier look. The Supersport 950 is a bike that is very easy to ride. The feedback that comes to the rider is very sporty. As well as the stability of the front end that offers great confidence to the rider, also to those who want to try their hand at sport riding on the track for the first time and experience the thrill of the knee on the ground. But with this bike, you can do much more.